you know, Sinji is he's so smart. Every time, if you have ever, like, hung out with him after he loses... Mm -hmm. Yeah, he's, he's immediately on. He's just like, okay, what yeah. did I do wrong? <laughs> yeah, like some, some How people, did I lose yeah, that? When, How do I yeah, fix no, that? Some people are like, oh my god, this game's stupid. Yeah. Oh, like, you know, so just like, I was doing this option wrong. I shouldn't have taken him to this stage. Dude, he, these options, these options, he, these options. He does these the options. Morpheus, my dude. He's right out of the Matrix, and he's like, all right, how do I get back in? Put me in a new insertion point. Put me in a better one. I want every odd in my favor. Um... But yeah, Miles too as well. I got to see him play earlier against, uh, I believe it was Frozen, and a very explosive in-your-face Yoshi. So it's interesting to yeah. see how that might coincide it's with- It's funny because yeah. it, he feels in your face, but if you notice, he's actually very careful with his spacing. He just uses mm. Yoshi's amazing aerial mobility to be just outside of range. And then the second he feels confident of actually going in on you, then he will pull that trigger. Mm -hmm. And Yoshi very able to do that as well. We see a little bit of uh, spacing out here with Ed. Eggs is eggs very good projectile and you know Sinji's playing a little bit back not trying to find his way into any grabs like he does right there. Steals item. All right. Ooh. Oh, that was so that was really smart. Yoshi actually went for the sour spot of forward air because that would launch the uh, hydrant at that sort of forward oh. angle. Oh. That's a smart call. Yep. One of those ladders, catching the landing. Yep, it's very difficult <laughs> to get down from Yoshi, man. What a stock it's... right there. And there was the there was the reset, the lock in the middle of it. Mm -hmm. How Why? are you going to get down, man? You got one air dodge, and Yoshi's got like six moves he's going to try to hit you with before you hit the ground. Right. Oh, and he's reading the shielding options also. Look, yep. after you get a stock like that happening to you, you kind of... You, you start to feel fear, yeah. and Miles is already one step ahead of that. And now we're seeing, too, Cindy trying to take a little bit more of an offense now that he's down a stock, and he can play back, but Miles does have the lead, and he can hold it. All right. Got oh, forward air was stale. Normally, forward air will break a full high jump, but because he had used it a few times, oh. it didn't at that point. Very easy. All right. Trying to find his way in a little bit here. Trying to bulldog himself in with the Nair. Give him the Hydra. That's a very oh. steep angle. Nice. And again, catching Sinji holding shield. A lot of times people feel comfortable shielding in front of Yoshi because what's he gonna do? His grab stinks. Mm -hmm. well, <laughs> nonetheless, his grab does still, you know, it, it catches you and puts you in disadvantage. And uh, this stale forward air when it comes to the hydrants is actually kind of throwing Miles off. Mm -hmm. He's so used to being able to just slam a hydrant out of existence with a single slap of the head. Well, even without that, we've still got Miles repping some edge guarding here. Very scary. Like, look at this ledge traffic. It's just, okay, great. Is it going to be another fair or is it going to be Nair? I just have to, I have to deal with this. I have to hold this. Oh, no. I'm off of it. Oh, no. I hope that wasn't true. Because that <laughs> well, so I think that that actually, because the forward air was so stale, it helped make sure that those two moves would connect. Oh, that's a decent point. And now we've got, this is really rough too, Cindy's, <laughs> Cindy's got to play aggressive into this Yoshi, and Yoshi can play a little bit back just like Cindy was trying to do at the start of the match. Oh, tries to go for the wave bounce command grab, not quite finding his mark there, but... Oh, no. He actually dropped out of it. Yeah, that third hit of down here not connecting, oh. going to be cleaning up the stock here, but when you look at this, the exact stock and percent count here, especially a player like Cindy, he can make comebacks, but he needs time to make comebacks. Mm -hmm. And... <laughs> Considering he's down by this much, I don't know if he has the time necessary without any massive explosive play of some kind. You see, the thing is, is that Pac-Man, hypothetically, does have very explosive play if he gets the right hit, and that's the thing. And Miles playing very safe right here, shooting out eggs, doing, like, <laughs> fadeaway nares, all the sort of things that he needs to do to try to hold this lead right now. Because if you do give Sinji an opening, Pac-Man known for those very damaging, very long combos, and Pac-Man does have kill power. All right, Tech Chase with the dash attack. Bringing his way back on the stage with eggs, trying to break the hydrant, sends it right back to him. Sends you trying to make something work with the fruit. Holding the fruit is actually a decent option when you have a lead right now. Pac-Man cannot summon his fruit again when you're holding it. Yeah, and not only that, but Yoshi still has access to a lot of good special moves between the egg and also a command grab with the neutral beat. Mm -hmm. Also, awesome. I believe Yoshi has a surprisingly fast item throw animation. Does he? Like his item throw. It used to be very fast, actually. I see. Actually, double check that good days. catch on that one. Caught the fadeaway Nair on that. Actually went a little under what it looked like. All right. Bell in play. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Not the play where Sinji likes to see it, though. No. And, all right, so Sinji now using the, the, the hydrant, just like 
going back and forth between it. Miles not really able to lock him down that effectively. When you think about it, Shinji started this stock at about 60%, and he has only taken, I think, one or two hits, whereas a mile is already dead down to his last life. Mm -hmm. Gonna get another bell confirm on that one. And again, Sinji can whittle down, like you said. He does need the time with another two minutes, 30 seconds on the clock. He can do that, and he can get the confirms after he's done a little bit of whittling. Dash attack here, Galaxian hit hair, uh, Apple hit there. It all adds up with Sinji's game plan. All right, continue the chase. Actually got him on the fadeaway. He was trying to fake him out. Oh, he had the read too. Miles is just waiting now. He knows he can get it with one good hit. Oh, he's looking for a roll read of some kind, but Sinji being careful not to give it to him. And now at 133%, this is very scary for Sinji, but at the same time, he's playing around what Miles wants to do. The back air is the most threatening move. And That's actually it. Yep. there, it doesn't kill. No. Okay, good DI. He's still in it. Still very scary place to be. And yes, like you're talking about, he's trying to find an opportunity where he can get in to do a little bit of this damage. Like if he lands with a fair like that on the shield, he can punish with Nair out of shield. But if he's spacing Ooh, out back Oh it. my god, that's it! He makes the comeback happen! I can't believe it! After Miles was doing so, so well for so much of that game. And that back air, you saw that back air, we thought it was over, but no. Back air is a move that scales really well with Rage, but because he was at such a lower percent, because he wasn't, he was winning too much, <laughs> he didn't kill. And then it ended up, he spot dodged. I'm not sure what he was going for there. Yeah, I think, I, I think what might have happened there, so we saw the shield drop when that had happened. We saw the like, oh no, the bell is coming. I better spot dodge the bell, which doesn't work. <laughs> bell is very active. I think maybe he was trying to spot dodge like an immediate attack option from Sinji. Maybe. You know, like a dash attack or something like that, perhaps. Mm -hmm. But even then, the bell was coming down at him. Yep. So we're going to go into game two on this one. Sinji with a really great comeback. Let's see how Miles can take this mentally, because comebacks like that can be a little bit draining. Let's see how it affects his game plan. Now, Miles is actually a player with very good composure, I would say. Mm. Uh, despite the fact that he's on the younger side of things, although young to, to me is. I, I don't even know what young is anymore. <laughs> oh, my. Yep. See, those are those conversions I'm talking about here. If you get the right hit with Galaxian, that's like 50%, if not a kill conversion. And then, of course, Bell is in the field. Yo, the way finish. <laughs> yeah, Sinji's spacing is so good right now, and it feels like whatever, you know, play style, however Miles was approaching this matchup at the beginning of last game, Sinji has changed what he's been doing, and he's he's just not getting hit by things. Mm -mm. He's playing it slow, and it's easy to get overwhelmed, especially with a character like Yoshi and how Miles plays it once he gets his offense going, but... Um, and you're just trying to take his time and make sure that he's safe as the main thing. If you can avoid getting damaged, how are you going to lose? Oh, that's oh. the trade in his favor. I don't, okay, so I don't think he wanted to wind up on stage. I think he might have wanted to grab to the ledge with the egg. Mm -hmm. Fade away, egg. I got you. Oh, so to explain that, forward smash, I believe, is only active for a single frame. So mm -hmm. that's actually frame perfect to try to uh, punish a neutral get up. Oh, shoot. Uh, very yeah. close, it looked like, too. Yeah, very close. I've seen him do it. It is, but it is not, it's something that's hard to do. Was that actually still a punish on the trampoline away? I'm not sure. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, trampoline's mad funny. Oh, oh no, no, it gets caught under PS2. He makes it back with the air dodge. He plants on the trampoline. Plant plant with <laughs> Trumpopoline. Yeah, Trumpopoline. <laughs> yeah. All right. Sinji with the bim bam on the flim flam going off slam. Blocks the back air on that one. Yep, a little too close on that one. Sinji's able to get him with the forward air out of shield. Great job. Place to Fan be. Yeah, fantastic weight from Miles. Mm -hmm. But he's still down by quite a bit. And considering the fact that he had a massive lead last time and actually still couldn't take the game, now that Sinji has what is unambiguously a, a gap in his favor, how was Miles going to fare? Mm -hmm. And honestly, the thing is, is that Sinji, although it's a little tough for Pac-Man to start an offense, um, and he's very strong on defense. It's not too hard for Yoshi to play a little bit of an offense as well as defense, because he's got some great buttons. So I think Miles could still make this work, although he does have his work cut out for him. Nice catch. All right, playing a little bit out on mid-screen here, trying to stay in the air, not looking to catch anything that Sinji might throw out. But again, he's just too close on the shield as Sinji is ready to punish. Yeah, I will say Miles not really disposing of the hydrant. You know, not trying to go for forward airs to break it so much anymore. Mm -hmm. Might be that since he's behind now, he's not trying to get himself too caught out because when you hit the hydrant, you do get frozen and hit stun. 
At the same time, though, look at the way Sinji is using the Hydrant to keep it, like, it's like a little barrier that oh, is helping him for sure. And I like that you saw the startup animations of the pivot grab from Miles, because normally it can be really, really hard to punish Pac-Man dash attack, but a well-spaced, um, oh, that's that, it. yeah, mm -hmm. very good. Mundo dead. Um, but yes, it is very hard to punish Pac-Man dash attack at a time if it is well spaced. Oh. And ooh, there's the conversion. Okay, edge guard attempt. Maybe he thought he was uh, a little bit off there, but all right, still has the stage. This is a very good position for Miles. Actually, does the fake out with the egg. All right, and di's in on the down throw. Never di in on Yoshi down throw. If he has you at the ledge and has grabbed you, just di out. Throw forward throw is not going to kill you. Even at this percent, could oh, he still no. have gotten the fair? What? Could he still have gotten... Or Forward throw doesn't reliably lead into anything. Oh, no, I meant the uh, the down throw you were saying. The DI in there. Oh, the, the down throw. So if you DI in, it's pretty much up air is the only move you can get off of it. I Forward air is just too slow. But at the same time, if you just DI out, it doesn't connect. Mm -hmm. Well, Yoshi now trying to still keep things fast here, but Sinji is keeping it slow. Willing to sit on this 131 here and get just, again, like little bits and pieces. 33% over a long period of time, but he's making it work. Yeah, and once again, he, Miles is at too low percent for that back air to kill. All right, good delay on the trampoline, so he doesn't need the back air coming back Ooh. in. Yes. Once again. It's so amazing how this happens. I feel like this goes on for so long. It's like, wait, how did Miles get 30 more percent? What happened? It's because Cindy just plays these very slow, <laughs> freaking pencil sharpener sort of percents until eventually you get to the point where, oh god. I've, I'm 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 the same stock of him now, but he's sixty percent. What happened? Yeah. Are you telling me <laughs> I, I'm if he hits me with Bell, I'm dead at ledge? Yeah. And keep in mind that the Bell has been the big difference maker here. Without if if Miles is able to play around that Bell effectively, then it's going to be a lot harder for Sinji to kill. At the same time, one minute and forty three seconds left on the clock, and oh, that Bell is scary in spot. It. Oh God. Good job beating yep. it out. Mm -hmm. Just empty lands and then shields immediately. Yep. But nonetheless, 111% on Miles. Actually <gasps> trades with that on the downer. That's good, because I probably would have been deaf if he hadn't. Oh. Uh, yep. Hydrant. Win boxes do allow for some weird spacing like that. All right. Playing it out a little too close on that back air again. That's getting him a lot of little percent over the course of the match. Ooh, oh, back air actually clips the top of his head. Yeah, and I'm surprised Miles is not trying to destroy this. I understand the, the fear of trying to destroy the higher end, especially given the spacing that uh, Sinji is at. But at the same time, Sinji is getting so much mileage uh -oh, off of that Hydra be being on the ground. Ooh. Yep. Still got a little bit of percent here, but Miles very slowly eating at 146 now. A lot Ooh. of stuff could potentially kill. Goes down the apple to try to cover. Oh, I think we saw the beginnings of a grab there, perhaps. One grab should do it, and oh, 99%. This, this is, is gonna absolutely happen. Oh no, okay, oh. good DI. Still in this. Oh, going really deep on it. Oh, oh it's attackable. Oh no. The very he was, end there. He was trying so hard to make it happen, and he almost made it happen. Oh. He, he had this one opportunity. He's like, I have Sinji off stage. This has to be it. I have to make it happen well, now. The amount of kill screens Miles has gotten. It's just, it's heartbreaking. That back air twice now has lied to him. And he's jumped back. Look how he loops around too, right? So the plan there is oh. like, okay, I'll loop. So if you want to chase me, go even further. Yeah, and so I think that in that exact situation, we actually, can we get that last replay? Yeah, let's get that back up. All right, so you see he goes off stage here. Gets the back air, but then there's this, here comes the reversal, right? He goes down there, he needs to jump back, and so you see the beginnings of egg throw come out. You're absolutely right. And that's right. why he got it. At that situation, if he had air dodged up and away, he maybe would have gotten back to stage. Perhaps. It could also be that, but let's actually, let's take a look at where this ended, right? Because mm -hmm. it connects here. Keeps going. Yeah. Because Sinji wanted to get to the ledge, he might have actually dodged it if he had gone for air dodge up and away in that situation. Mm. So They're... obviously hindsight is 50-50 and all that, but when we look here at the exact, um, you know, what, what could have been... By the frame. Yeah, by the frames, you saw the very, very start of that upbeat. Um, so, a late night end. So that's actually going to be the first uh, post-COVID 
uh, set that Sinji has taken from Miles. Yeah, that's right. So, so now he's got the set count to 2-1. Um, shoot. That yeah. was honestly, I feel like Sinji really did have that development where Miles came right out of the gate very strongly. Um, and then Sinji sort of wore him down a little bit. And like you said, there wasn't so much use with the Hydrant on that one.